Hi, so I'm here in our field of direct drilled oilseed rape and we're experiencing some deja vu. So last year we, we drilled some, planted some with this method and then the, the weather went really dry and it dried up and got eaten by the flea beetle and the slugs. And guess what the weather's doing this time? So here is our row of direct drilled oilseed rape and it's kind of at its most vulnerable stage here. Just want to show you over here we've got some flea beetle damage so there's little holes in these ones and this one here. So what I'm doing is I'm setting a flea beetle trap. So this yellow disc will attract them in like it's kind of the uh, colour of the uh, leaves and the pollen they're looking for and they'll land on there and get stuck in the water. So I can come back, see how many are in there, see what kind of problem we've got and we can kind of decide how best to tackle it. Hi, so it's 48 hours since I set the flea beetle traps and I've just come to see what's in them. So there's quite a lot of flies in there and that's a good thing, it shows us a lot of life in our fields and there's quite a few kind of parasitic wasps which are good predators in here. Just show you some down there. There are also some bee flea beetle which are there. But to be honest, I can only see three flea beetle in this trap so that's really good. So as long as it rains soon, hopefully this rape crop will get going. Cheers!